Germany signed a historic agreement with Israel to purchase the Aero 3 anti-missile defense system. This decision, which was preceded by approval from the United States, was already reported by Army Recognition on August 17, 2023. A sales agreement between Israel and Germany concerning the Aero 3 anti-missile system took place on September 28, 2023, in Berlin. The agreement was signed by German Defense Minister Boris Pistorius and Israeli Defense Minister Yov Gallant. This is an unprecedented agreement between the two nations. The Aero 3 system is more than just a simple missile. It is a hypersonic exoatmospheric anti-ballistic missile, a technology developed jointly by Israel and the United States. Designed by Israel Aerospace Industries, IAI, and Boeing, the system is capable of intercepting ballistic missiles, including intercontinental ballistic missiles, ICBMs, carrying nuclear, chemical, biological, or conventional warheads. The missile can reach hypersonic speeds and has a reported flight range of up to 2,400 kilometers. The system was launched in 2008 with the aim of achieving 99% effectiveness. But that's not all. The Aero 3 system is also capable of serving as an anti-satellite weapon. This positions Israel among the few nations capable of shooting down satellites. The system also has a unique, divert motor, capability, which allows the kill vehicle to radically change direction. This flexibility allows it to pivot to see approaching satellites, adding another layer of complexity and versatility to this system. The acquisition of the Aero 3 by Germany is a world first. Never before has Israel sold this advanced anti-missile defense system to another nation. Germany thus becomes the first country outside of Israel to acquire this cutting-edge system. Moreover, this is the first time that Israel has sold this kind of armament systems to Germany. This decision could have major geopolitical implications for both Germany and Israel. Germany's acquisition of the Aero 3 system significantly increases its ability to defend against ballistic threats. This could serve as a deterrent against potential aggressions. It could also have implications for relations with other NATO countries and even beyond, as Germany positions itself as a military power equipped with advanced defense technology. In summary, signing this agreement is an important milestone not only for relations between Germany and Israel but also for strengthening German anti-air defense. It also impacts Germany's allies, such as NATO member countries and those part of the European Union. Given the current geopolitical context, a historic delivery of this kind of armament is more than welcome.